Some species of bacteria can produce spores, called endospore, means the spore inside the cells. And this, this species, Bacillus and Clotium, these are two species of bacteria which can produce spore. And why we should talk about spore? Because spores are very resistant to heat, to chemicals, to dry conditions, quite difficult to destroy them, to kill them. And then when they meet suitable condition, when there is uh, water again, for example, the spore can germinate into cells, into living cells, and then they will multiply. The spore will germinate into living cell. We call it vestigial cell. Vestigial or living cell. And then that time they will multiply in number. The spores do not multiply, okay? But they can survive these other spores. When there are some stress condition, they will form spore inside the cell and then the cell will die, but the spore will survive for a long time, even in very dry condition. And they do not multiply the spore like an egg. Eh? But when they meet suitable condition, they germinate into living cell, then that time they will multiply in number. So when we do, for example, sterilization, when we do sterilization, so we have to calculate a process to destroy the spores, not to destroy the vestigial cell, because these are quite simple to destroy, but the spore much more difficult to destroy.